hey guys welcome back to my channel today's video will be about how to treat and prevent split ends so don't forget to like share comment and subscribe turn on your post notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post let's get into it <music> split ends is something that i have experienced and trust me it's not a good look it's not a good feeling to have you here and each time you comb it you're seeing not just small amounts coming out on your comb or coming out on your brush it's really not a good feeling as a woman especially a woman who love them here well i supposed to think that everybody loved them here but say that to say this it's not something that you can feel comfortable with now i'm going to tell you how i go about eliminating the amount of split ends i have and i'm also going to share with you how i go about treating it when it arrives so one of the few things you can do to prevent split ends is wrapping your hair at night especially at night when you're going to your bed wrap your hair you're not just going to wrap your hair if it's dry you're going to add moisture of course now adding moisture you can go through section by section depending on the time span you have you go through section by section not small small sections but you go through section by section and you moisturize it now you're going to focus on the ends also so it's either you're going to use coconut oil or you use small amounts of castor oil or you can use vaseline if you have that if you don't have the other forms of organic oils you can use the Vaseline to moisturize the ends of your hair but you're not going to darb it in your hair you understand you're going to use small amount and you focus mainly on the ends of your hair because that's where the problem lies the second thing I want to share with you is the amount of heat being trapped in your hair now we as women love when we're here laid and slayed but trust me if you have a bag of split ends there's no laid and slayed to that so what you can practice is minimizing the amount of heat being trapped in your hair so for example if you're going to flat iron your hair you wash your hair or you cream your hair or you know you're gonna flat iron it what you can do is minimize the amount of heat so you know you're gonna flat iron it don't blow dry it i advise you to allow it to air dry and then afterwards you moisturize and you go through with your flat ironing process now i want to add something else when it comes on to flat ironing now as i stated early on it is no good for our hair so if i said to you early on that you should eliminate the amount of time you use the flat iron while using the blow dryer it's the same process when it comes on to flat ironing your hair or often you flat iron your hair because if you're the type of person to get up every morning and use the iron sooner rather than later you're going to experience a lot of split ends so if you can prevent yourself from using excess amount of heat in your hair please do so another important tip that I want to share with you when it comes on to protecting the ends of your hair is plaiting the end of your hair now if you have challenges wrapping your hair you can also practice this method also you can plait the ends of your hair and secure with a rubber band now if your hair is long and the security of the rubber band is not enough because it's going to pull through your bun your ear bonnet what you can do is wrap it around after you've plaited and secured the rubber band you can just wrap it around and use an ear pin to secure it now trust me i recently learned about this and it's working wonders for me so you can try the last thing i want to share with you is moisturizing yes this is the same way our, our body need water or hair needs moisture moisturizing your hair from the root to the ends go a far way practice moisturizing your hair when it's needed so you're not going to get up every day and if your hair still feel moist you're going to go through and moisturize same way you're wasting product and you're adding excess amount of moist to your hair but whenever it's needed please do so okay so it's treatment session now my lovely people split ends cannot be repaired 
I repeat, split tents cannot be repaired. Now, in order to get your ear back intact, what you have to do is to get rid of them completely. And how you do so is to cut them off. Don't go ahead and moisturize a damaged hair. So if you have split ends really bad, it's best to treat it before it reach to the roots. Get rid of them. It will grow back. Trust me, it will grow back. So guys, if you're suffering from split ends, get rid of them. Now we've come to the end of this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, bye.